Yes, let us begin. I'm, I'm, ha I'm. It's about time I do something. Like, I really wanted to do this for the longest time, but uh, most of the raid bosses that are ready for season three, they've already been done training. So, uh, yeah, I figured, you know what? And this raid boss might actually end up appearing some point in season three. I'm gonna try to sneak uh, better than you in there. But we are here for the Richter raid boss, which I did name after better than you, who is a person that has showed up to all three of my final boss amiibos. So yeah, this is not a final boss, but it, it's still it's still named in honor of uh, of uh, better than you because obvious reasons. So that's why I kind of also want to get him into season three towards the tail end somewhere. But uh, so Richter has quite a bit of uh, well, quite a bit at his arsenal. Oh, let me there we go, there we go. That's what I needed. So I love his up smash, but I don't want to use that too often. I want to use it, you know, very sparingly, just so he knows he has the ability to do so. Another thing. Down special into forward smash. I need to get that ingrained into his brain. Down special, forward smash. Just like that. Perfect. Well, let's do, do it again. One more time. Yes, let's go. See, that's one thing with Amiibos early on that at least I feel that uh, uh, it's definitely helpful. You have to do the basic stuff very well and very often early early in training do that during the very low levels of training again whether it's a regular vanilla amiibo or whether it's a raid boss amiibo whatever it happens to be do it early in training that way they get used to it oh come on give me that come on we got we're gonna be doing that a lot you're gonna see a lot of down special into forward smash or forward tilt let's try again one more yes we need to teach him that that is one of his best little I mean, I, yeah, that's a combo. We need to teach him that. Come on, let's go again. Oh, I just missed it. Let's see if we can't. I'm going to try it one more time. Oh, okay. We're going to have a whip off. We're going to have a whipping battle. I'm going to win this, though. I'm going to win. I mean, you're only level 10, so you shouldn't even do nothing, right? Right? Oh, missed it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Um, uh, I don't know if I want to use throws too often. If I do, i got to make sure I'm using them in the, direct, uh, the correct direction. I don't really like uh, Richter and Simon's throws too much. Oh, there we go. There's a nice little one. It wasn't at the edge, but uh, as long as they connect to each other, that's always good. Oh, I should I should have let him hit that forward smash. The more, again, here's another big big tip for everybody. When when you are training, let let the amiibo hit the attack. The more often they hit the attack, the more likely they are to use it. So if you're trying to dodge and roll and you know just get away from it and avoid the attack, the amiibo is gonna think to itself, all right. This is not what I'm. This is not what I should do. If I can't connect the attack, then the attack is no good. And no, no, no. You do not want to do that. Ooh, big forward smash. We got to let him start hitting us with uh, a lot more forward tilts because I think forward tilt, hands down, is the best neutral option that Richter and well Simon they, that they have. So we got to do a lot more forward tilts, and then hopefully he starts hitting us with a few forward tilts as well. Yes, yes. Get into their brain. Ingrain that into their brain. Yes, there you go. There you go. There's a few forward tilts that he connected. We like that. The more he does that, the more likely he is to use that attack. And I would love to see him use that as his primary attack for anything. There's a up smash. Um, I could have handled that situation a little bit better. But again, we got to make sure that we mix it up. Just a little bit, because I don't want him to rely on only forward smash for KOs, all right? Up smash is okay in very situational circumstances. And I think down smash, which I might try to work on a little bit later. To, oh, nice little combo right there. But uh, down smash, I think, is all right as well. So that might be something I throw in there very sparingly as well. But uh, yes, so far, so good. Oh, that back air too. We got, oh, the back air. That thing is amazing. All right, so one thing I want to make sure I don't do too much is I start with a projectile. Do not, if you're training your own, because this goes for both characters. If you're training a Simon or a Richter, do not get too spammy with the projectiles because then the amiibo itself becomes extremely spammy. Like, axes, I think, are fine at the ledge for ed ledge guard. That is completely okay. And then, of course, the down special at the ledge as well. Try to combo that into a forward tilt or forward smash is all right but do not get spammy with the projectiles because it severely messes with the amiibo 
Yes, there we go. That's big. That's big right there. We need to see more of that. Let him do those attacks to us. Let him hit those attacks. Forward tilt, forward smash, up smash if he hits it properly, down smash if he can hit it properly. That's fine. Let him get those KOs with those moves. That's what the early training is all about. Letting them hit you with specific attacks so they know to use it. Ooh, see? Not bad right there. I want him to learn that now. Use them axes at the ledge. I know that, like, that first one, I think, uh, I didn't need it because he was pretty much done. But hit the attacks anyway. Because that way, the more you, again, I can't, I can't, yes! Big smash attack right there. That's good. That's good. He's learning that forward smash is a great KO option. Now, I just need you, oh, he's going for it again. That's okay. I mean, it's okay, but it's not okay. But it's, it's okay. Oh, there you go. It's another big forward smash. Good. He's learning. He's picking up on these tendencies a little bit, which is good. And the thing is, he's using forward smash at a distance, which you should properly use. So he's picking up on that. I like what I'm seeing in training so far. He's doing good. Okay. I mean, that one he kind of used a little close range, but still. Okay. I, I, I missed time that one, but no. Uh, so far, I like, it's still very early. I mean, he's only level 21. But it's still very early, but uh, so far, I'm liking what I'm seeing. Let's get another up smash. Down smash. Why did I go for down smash? What am I doing? That was not the time for it. Oh, <laughs> this is the part of the training. Right around level 30. Right around level 30 is when they start to kind of, kind of, you know, put everything together. Their amiibo brain just hasn't fully developed yet, so whatever they've kind of been taught so far, which again is the basic forward tilt is amazing, and then, you know, down special into forward smash or forward tilt, it's great. Uh, gotta watch out for the axes at the ledge. So, like, again, he's learning the basic stuff, which is great. Okay, that's fine. I'll, I'll take that one. I will gladly take that one. But, yeah, around level 30, they're starting to put it together, starting to become actually kind of a bit of a challenge because, like, their spirits are kicking in, so his power on these attacks are getting a lot more, a uh, lot more stronger. So uh, right now, I actually kind of want to focus on down smash. I want to get a few KOs with down smash, and then hopefully he will try down smash as well. There we go. We're hitting some down smash. I'm not getting the sweet spot, but uh, I'm gonna keep trying down smash. Oh, missed it. Oh, forward tilt. Good, good. He's hitting forward tilt. There we go. Down smash. Beautiful. I hit it. So now I need to. I want to see him start using that just a little bit. Just a little bit more. Again, forward smash is the best smash, but down smash ain't too bad either. Ooh, nice. There's another down smash KO. There's another one. See, got to do it. Got to do it. Like, see, when you start training something, when you're trying to go for a specific move, uh, it's it's not good to spam. Oh, my God. You just beat me. Um, That didn't happen. No, but see, that's the thing. When you're going for a certain move, especially a little bit later in training, I think the smartest thing to do is not necessarily spam the move. So, for example, my down smash. I'm not necessarily spamming it, but I'm using it more often than not. And then I kind of leave myself open uh, during certain parts of the training here. Oh, as I missed the ledge, that's not... Is he going to beat me again? He better not. <laughs> but uh, I'm leaving myself open a little bit for him to try to take advantage of that. So it's, again, going back to that first point, you want to let the amiibo connect their attacks. If they can't do that, they're not going to learn which attacks they need to actually use. Oh, I missed it. That would have been beautiful. I can't lose this again. I cannot, <laughs> I can't lose again, man. Could you imagine losing back to back? I mean, grant, oh my God, no, 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 no. Um, yep. Um, yep. I'm, I'm <laughs> I lost two in a row. He's only level 34. Oh, fuck. That was, that, was, that was a rough one. That was a rough one. But we're finally... Look, I just <laughs> I skipped a lot. There was a, there's a lot of stuff in the middle, but it's kind of like, eh, well, I don't think we really need to see this. So we got him all... We're up here to level 49 now. We're getting close to level 50. He's almost done. But just because you reach level 50 does not mean you're done. I cannot stress that enough. So many people... That was a nice dodge by me, but couldn't capitalize on it. So many people miss make that mistake. Come on, hit me. Down smash, yes, he's learning, he's doing it, he's doing it, he's been doing it, oh, woo. oh my god, I'm gonna get three stocked by the raid boss, I'm gonna get three stocked by the raid boss, 
But so many people make that mistake during training. They hit level 50 and they immediately go, save, I'm done. I'm telling you right now, that is not the end. There we go. Okay, we're not getting very stopped. But I'm telling you right now, that is not how training works. Get them to level 50, but then you have to continue battling them to see what you need to continue working on. Does he need to do this a little bit better? Does they Do they dodge too much? Are they not hitting this attack enough? Whatever it is, then you continue working on it from there. But just because you're level 50 doesn't mean they're done. So many amiibos are really bad because, well, their trainers make that mistake. And I'm just trying to let you guys know. Do not make that mistake. Oh, die monster! I thought you were the monster, not me! Die monster! Oh no! Oh no! He's all... Oh, then I just get walled by that axe! Oh, that axe does so much damage! That axe does so much damage, dude! I love it! But I think he's kind of using it a little too much, which we got. To, we're gonna have to keep an eye on. If he uses it at the ledge, no problem. But if he's using it on stage, that's a problem. That is a problem. So we're gonna have to keep an eye on that for once he finally hits level 50 and we're done. There we go. There we go. Some damage. Oh, yeah. I just got three stocks. Um, he's getting better. Oh, by the way, let me. Oh, <laughs> ouch. <laughs> By the way, I need to throw this out there, and again, if anyone's thinking about training a Richter or a Simon Amiibo, and you're like, okay, how do I get them to tether grab? How do I get them to use their whip to uh, help with their recovery? You do not need to train that. That's hard-coded into them. They will do that on their own. So if they ever go off stage, let's see if we can get it right here, actually. See if he does it. See? He did it right there. It's hard-coded into them. They will do it themselves, okay? You don't need to teach them that, just so you know. But again, the smart... Richter and the Smart Simon Amiibo. Keep them on stage. Do not go off stage. Their recovery is garbage, okay? Their recovery is garbage. Even with the whip from a distance, yeah, okay. But still, the recovery is terrible. Stay on the stage. Use those projectiles at the ledge to protect that ledge. You know, ledge guard against the opponent. You have to teach that. You have to teach ledge guarding. If they don't know how to do that, well, then they're just going to kind of like sit at the ledge and go... Oh, they might do that too, a big forward smash. <laughs> but uh, they're going to sit at the ledge and just kind of go, ah, what do I do? What do I do here? So you got to teach them ledge guard. You really have to teach them the basics of Smash Bros. So, yeah. All right, he finally reached level 50, but now we got to break out some other characters to play against, right? He's been playing against Richters the whole time. What if we break out a super heavyweight? Let's bring out King K. Rule, see how we do. Well, I just <laughs> went for that back air immediately because, I mean, if he's going to go off stage, which he shouldn't, but, I mean, I kind of knocked him off stage, but if he's going to go off stage, we're going to have to try to punish him, right? We li have to... Oh, my God! He broke my armor! That's so unfair! Forward smash! He didn't get the sweet spot, but, oh, with his increased stats and his spirit help, uh, yeah, it probably didn't matter that he didn't get... Well, yeah, it didn't matter that he didn't get the sweet spot. Oof! Oh! Broke my armor. That one, that one really hurt. That one really hurt. Okay, he's got the he's got the axes at the ledge down. He's got that one down. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, bro. Okay, I see you. I see you. That's fine. That's fine. Wow, he's got the first two stocks. I'm kidding. I, I got to make a comeback here. I can't just lose to a, an unfinished raid boss. I mean, yes, I have already lost to an unfinished raid boss, but like. We got to get, oh, we went with the up special. No, no, no. You better not be doing that more. Do not do that more. That's bad. That leaves you wide open and vulnerable. If you try to attempt that, you miss. That's not good. He's done. Get him down. Get down there. Get down there. <laughs> got to teach him. Hey, you got to teach him. You're going to go off stage. I have to punish you in some sort of way, right? I will spike you. I will do that. It will happen. This is the world of Smash Bros, after all. Oh, come on. Give me that. Give me that. I wanted that so bad. I gotta hit that reflect on that axe. Ooh, that could have been nice. Ah, that could have been nice. Yes, he's done. He's done. What? Excuse me. No way you made that. I'm gonna have to. Uh, what? How? 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 His whip is bigger than mine. All right, he got a taste of the big croc. But now let's let's break out Terry. Let's see if I can uh, kind of teach him some manners. And then after, oh, well, it'd help if I move. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Why was I just stand I just stood there. It's like, ah, he won't attack me. Nah, he did. All right, he passed the test. That's what that was. I wanted to see if he'd be aggressive right out of the gate. Good. I like it. I like it. All right, come on. Let's go. We gotta, we gotta like kind of combo on. I'm not gonna style on him because 
I can't do that. I'm not that great of a player, but, uh... Oh my god, is one axe broke my full shield? Okay, yeah, okay, take note. One neutral special can break an, a full shield. Just, just keep that in mind, everybody, for once he does come, finally come out as a raid boss. Keep that in mind. Oh my goodness, okay. Let's go, we need to come back here, we need to come back here. No, I want it down air. Oh, I want to, I want to spike him so bad. I want to spike him so bad. I gotta uh, at least look kind of good. There we go. Forward smash. Not enough. Here we go. I'll catch him with the forward. Yes, good time there. Yes. I'm gonna. I'm telling you. You go off stage. If I can knock you the. Oh, ouch. If I can knock you far enough off stage, I'm going. What? No, I caught his holy water. And and then I caught Nell too. Oh. Okay. Okay. That was <laughs> that was a bit unfortunate. Well, looks like he's ready to whoop my ass.